I grew up in Laguna Beach, California. I spent a lot of time at the beach. I remember every summer I had to do junior lifeguards, which is awful. You're basically like little kids with six packs because you've been working out all summer. I love clothes and I love making things and I used to sew with my little tiny sewing machine. Um, so just from a very young age, it was just what I wanted to do and because I'm stubborn, no one can tell me differently. <laughs> The first time I can remember being aware of drug use around me is as early as, as sixth or seventh grade. In the beginning, I didn't really understand. I think that I was just still very young and didn't understand exactly what drugs were. There was just this group of kids who just did drugs all the time and everyone knew it. And you're getting ready to go to college within a few years and you're worried about your GPA and you know worried about your future. And I think that when you're so involved in drugs, you have such a lack of interest there, and you just don't really care about your future. After I graduated high school, I moved to San Francisco for a little while, went to the Academy of Art University there. Then I moved back and decided to move to LA to go to FITM. And once I got into LA, I wasn't just you know going to college, I was also involved in the entertainment industry, and I think that that was a point where I saw drug use at a whole new level. When you're in Hollywood, you get into drugs and you don't show up for your call time and it gets out there that you're getting into bad things, like that's your career, you know, that's your future. It's sad that people come and they have this bright future and they're so talented and it's just, it's the same story over and over and over and people don't really learn from it. I don't know if there was one specific thing that you know, encouraged me not to do drugs. I just genuinely didn't want to do them. I just, it didn't seem that cool to me and it didn't look that fun. So I just never really had an interest. Even when I started filming the first show, I knew that my end goal was to end up in the fashion industry. I knew that I wanted a clothing line. I wanted to be involved with design. So. Through the show, I, I made a lot of relationships that helped me out until I kind of reached a point where it made sense to do and I was able to do my first line. With fashion, it was just ever since I was little, this is what I want to do, this is what I'm going to do. Writing was an unexpected opportunity, so that was something where we got into it and then I was like, I really love doing this. And then it came to the time where the book was released and, you know, nobody really knew what to expect and then, you know, in that first week when I got the call that it was a number one bestseller, like, that's just not something you expect. My name is Lauren Conrad and my natural high is getting to design beautiful clothing.